Sup everyone, my name is Chris Lou, and I'll tell you this now, it is good to be back. It has been far too long since I've been into this, and I think my phone, my camera's not phone, my camera's actually... Uh, that looks to be about right. Yay! Anyway, I have been away for... God, why does that still seem off? Good. Now, I've been away for about three weeks, keeping up regularly with you guys as much as I can with my camera, with my phone. I've been just been recording, throwing it up on YouTube. For those of you who don't know, my computer was doused with Dr. Pepper. Um, and my previous one, at least. I got a new one, but this one's only temporary. Um, I got a new one, but it was doused with Dr. Pepper. It was just dripping with it when I came home. I kind of know who did it. Uh, anyway, I was away for a couple weeks. Just a few days ago, I got this, uh, actually about four or five days ago, I got this new computer. It's an Asus. Uh, it doesn't have Windows 10, and I'm not upgrading it yet, because come beginning of March, I'm going to be getting my taxes back, and then I'm going to go out and get a huge um, gaming laptop. It's going to be expensive, but I'm fully prepared for that. But I'm going to be able to go do that and get that set up. And then I'll have more games available for you guys, more videos, uh, be able to do a whole lot more than I did with my previous computers. Might actually be able to do Dead by Daylight without my computer lagging out to all hell. Now, one more thing I do want to say. It's been a couple weeks, so I want to show you guys this. Um, I've kept up with this. This is all back now, and it's going to stay quasi because my girl likes it. Well, not likes it. She much tolerates it. But anyway, I want to show you something that's been happening the past couple weeks. Many of you guys already know this, but my hair is long as hell. Very, very long. And I have no plans in the future to get it cut. So, alright, anyway, this is Moonbase Alpha. I'm going to be doing a collab with Joe, Mickey, and a few others, I believe, John, uh, in the future. And he told me about this a couple days ago. So I thought, why not go ahead and give it a run? So let's see if I don't screw up completely. Um, create. Uh, okay, one to two players. This new settlement is best for small two-person teams or single player. I have no idea what this game's about. Something to do with the moon and NASA. Restore oxygen product in under 20 production in under 25 minutes, or else you and your team will fail the mission. Completing the objective adds your score to the moon base alpha leaderboards. It's cute. It I don't know what that means. Uh, competitive play, competitive mode, free play mode. Let's just do free play instead of competitive. The mouse is a bit wonky. It might just be because I'm recording. Um, play in offline mode. And we'll just play regular. And create. When power is reaching a coupler through a secured cable, it's like appears. I didn't get to read that part. Uh, let's go ahead and give it a start. In the year 2020, NASA began construction of the lunar base near the Shackleton Crater, the Shackleton Crater at the South Pole of the Moon. Now in 2025, utilization of solar energy and regular has allowed the base to self-sustain. Oh, God. Pause that and read it if you can. Lunar Base yes. Alpha, this is Research Team Beta. Over. Copy that, Beta. Go ahead. We're returning from the field. We should be back at the outpost in less than five minutes. This is actually Over. pretty good graphics for a free game. This is free on Steam, by the way. Copy that, Beta. We'll see you in five minutes at NASA. I'm gonna set this over here because my what? cat likes to jump. That? You guys know that. Looks like, like aliens and stuff on here. Maybe a meteor strike. Smashed up the solar ring, something terrible, and knocked out the living quarters of export system. Stay that. We need your Would help. You cut it out. We're running out of oxygen. Work. We need to get that solar array online and let support system repaired ASAP. All the supplies you need Whoa. should be in the equipment shed. Jumped. Readings show the area around the life support system is too hazardous to approach on foot. So make sure to deploy repair robots. Please hurry. Copy that, en route. I don't know what to do. <laughs> Something about robots and other stuff, I don't know. Cinematic, okay. This is HQ. The meteor strike has crippled our base and shut down oxygen production. Okay. We need to repair the damage immediately. Here's okay. how oxygen production works. The solar panels absorb energy from the sun. Okay. The power cables and couplers transfer this energy to the power distributor. The distributor powers the life support system, which creates oxygen that is piped to the living quarters. 
Damaged equipment is indicated by a colored icon on your map. Okay. You must repair our base and restore oxygen production. Go to the equipment shed to get supplies. There's work to be done. All right. The couplers need repairs Ooh, ASAP, or smooth. else the life support system oh, okay. won't have power. Pick up a welding torch at the equipment shed and begin repairs on the couplers. Welding torch. And Move begin. your mouse to look around the world. Walk using the W A S and D keys. Look around the world. The, the world's up there, quick. Drungus. While the object is glowing, left click to interact with it. Okay, so I need. The equipment shed contains replacement equipment, tools, and robots. Access the equipment shed by left clicking on it. Okay, what do I need? I don't know what left I need. Left click on the equipment you would like to retrieve, and then click the accept button. Um, left click on the tools category. Let's go. Solar panel accept. Can I jump? No, not yet. I need to replace a solar panel, right? Solar panel is operational. So actually, I need to set this thing down. I'm going to put you down. Because I don't need you right now. And apparently, I can't walk over it. Uh, blinded. Okay. Hopefully, I can get this done in under... Uh, hey, look, my timer's up there. I'll try to get it done in 15. Uh... Construct Create a customized robot that can safely approach the life support system and aid in your repairs. Robot with welding tor- Hello! Nice to meet you! Alright. Anyway, um... Right click to drop the case. Left click on the case. Where am I going? And select deploy to control the robot. Okay, those, those look like the cables over there. Try to get close, because I, I don't know what's going on right now. Kind of lost at the moment. O2, I don't know what this means. What's all this crap? Ugh, everything looks like... What, what are those things over it? Uh, deploy the robot... What's going on? Okay. That is an ugly some bitch right there. Look at that. Press F1 at any time to access help and a complete list of game controls. Move the Whoa, what, using what? the standard movement key and left click to interact. Okay, okay, so WASD turns the thing. I'm gonna go see what this is. This is red, and I don't like red. This component is heavily damaged and will take okay. a long time to repair. Okay. Will be Fair enough, I suppose. The repair circle tracks your repair progress. What, what am I doing? What, what's this? What's there this? There is a potential bypass to the circuit that will save you. Ugh, crap! Left click on one end of the circuit and move the That's mouse to the connection to the other end. Okay. So it's going to take a while. Okay, so I actually got to connect these two things here like that. Oh, okay. 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 Four seconds saved. Ooh, four measly freaking seconds. Damn it! I'm just blowing ass. Some like severe major ass today. Ah, oh, God. So I can't leave a little green spot. Okay, success. Four seconds saved. Okay. Okay, got that. Uh, five seconds saved. Not bad. Not bad, I suppose. Um, come on. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Come on, give me another one. Okay, so it's got to do that small one right up there. Alright, good. Five seconds saved. Alright. Critical in nine seconds. What the hell, man? Don't screw me over like that, bro. Alright, so we got it going. Alright. Looks like we almost got it gone. Power to critical coupler has been cut. What? In this case, we got one. Where the damage component. 
what Great. needs to be repaired. That coupler is now fully functional. There's still an extensive amount of damage along the power network. Use your welder to fix any damage. Okay. I'm trying. This looks to be foobard. So let's check this out. Alright, so let's check that out. Okay. Near repair, repair destroyed component. Okay. Alright, I think I have an I think I know what I need to do now. Okay, let's exit the robot. Alright, so we need to go back to this shed thing here. Okay, I'm about halfway done on this, so we might have to cut this into multiple parts, which is fine. So I can actually turn this guy. So he turns with my mouse, alright. Okay. I love the graphics on this thing. These ain't, ain't too bad at all. Replacement equipment. Um, coupler, okay. Let's do that. Alright. Now, I said I could jump. Let's see what happens. Oh! Why well, that just nice. Can I run? No. So, oh, I gotta trudge my way over to do this? Blech. I'm gonna go over to me robot over there and replace this thing. Hmm. The lights on the equipment display the power flow of the component. Okay. Green components are receiving power. Red components are not. Left click on a damaged item and select repair. Okay. Okay, what's this? Put that down. Let's pick you up. Can I can I like trash you or something or what? Should I just like I'm just gonna set it down because maybe that helps. Okay. Pick it up. Okay. So I'm going to set that down. I don't want to pick you up yet. I want to. I want to do something, but I'm not sure what. What is this? Beacon? I don't need a beacon, do I? But how much weird crap do I need to do? Okay. Alright, so let's... Alright. Subject does not need repaired, but how do I... Erg. Okay, what happens if I just highlight that thing? Oh, do I need the arm robot? I don't know what I'm the boat to do. So, I'm gonna set this guy down. Uh, to exit robot. Oh my god, Zinch, do you have to? Try to get that robot with an arm. That might help. I have no freaking idea what I'm doing. You guys are probably sitting there laughing your asses off because I'm so blind. Can I seriously just not, like, pick it up myself? Robot with arm. Alright, let's accept. Alright. Let's see what happens. I can't jump with a freaking robot. That's not a master alarm. Low oxygen level. Well, I'm giving it my best shot. You're probably gonna die, but I'm giving it my best shot. <laughs> don't 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 screw up, please. I've got just a few minutes left. 
Alright, now. Dude, cut it out. Still an ugly sound bitch, I swear. Alright. Uh, I have really put him in quite a pickle here. Oh my god! Oh my god, I suck so much ass! Oh god, cut it out! Oh god! Oh man, I'm terrible today. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh god, screw this. How do I do that? I don't know what to do, I swear. <sighs> what do I do? What do I freaking do? Dude, what are you doing? Can I, can I, can I please touch this? Oh my god, touch it! It was that simple the whole time. God, I'm an idiot today! The power cable is attached, but the connection is not secured. Use a wrench to secure the connection. What? I need to go- Oh my god, screw this! And I'm stuck. Oh god, I don't think I'm gonna have time to finish this one off. Alright, I'm going to go grab the tool, then I'm probably going to cut this one short, because my camera still is only 20 minutes at a time. And hopefully to get a new camera with this money, too. Anyway, let's pick up the wrench, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys so much for watching. Link to this game is going to be in the description. It's free on Steam, as well as the National Alliance on Mental Illness. Support them in any way you can. And the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline. If you or someone you know is suffering, feel free to make those resources available. I am highly important. Left click on the welding torch, and then click the extension button. Um, I need a wrench and a welding torch, alright. Anyway, thank you guys so much for hanging with me when I needed it. Uh, and especially during this tough time. Um, it's been a while, so, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, I'll see you guys later. Okay, there was somebody in a window. Towards the ghost. Does that make a difference here?